The aim of controlled droplet applicator technology is to produce a chemical solution in a uniform droplet size that can be defined as optimum for the target. CDA technology uses centrifugal force rather than hydraulic pressure to form spray droplets. Centrifugal force is supplied by a spinning cup or disc powered by a small electric motor. CDA technology produces spray droplets that are relatively uniform in size and permits the applicator to control the droplet size. In contrast, conventional spray nozzles produce droplets that vary widely from small droplets that may drift or evaporate before reaching their target to large droplets that concentrate too much of the pesticide in one spot. The key to CDA technology is a rotary spray nozzle that creates a consistent droplet size and uniform pattern width. With the rotary nozzle, spray solution accumulates at the bottom of the spinning cup and spray droplets are created by the centrifugal force of this cup as it forces the spray solution up a series of grooves inside the cup. When the spray solution reaches the top of the cone-shaped nozzle, droplets are thrown in a circular hollow cone pattern. The patented technology used by Environmist Industries utilizes the efficiency and economy of controlled droplet applicators CDA, while containing the droplet cloud within a confined area using a dome or cover. The CDA spray system uses a spinning disc rotary atomizer to give the optimum size evenly distributed spray drops for maximum spray efficiency. This allows ultra-low spray volumes to be used, which minimizes chemical waste, environmental contamination, and operating downtime. The use of the shroud or shield minimizes drift, increases the effectiveness of the CDA, and enables in the otherwise unacceptable wind, air temperature inversion, or thermal updraft conditions when conventional spraying equipment cannot be used. Each spray head on all Environmist CDA sprayers is equipped with a flow gauge and flow control valve. This makes calibration straightforward and easy. All you have to know is the amount of chemical to be applied per sprayed acre. And this is found on the relevant information sheet for the chemical you're using. If in doubt, contact your agrimist or your chemical supplier for advice. Once you know the amount of chemical per acre, use the chart which is found in the Environment's Parts and Operators Manual and calculate the required speed. We've also included a chart to help you know how many acres you can cover with the tank you're using. Mounting an Environment CDA sprayer on an ATV or small tractor enables higher application speeds and minimizes labor and vehicle operating costs. Overall spraying cost savings of 50 to 75 percent have been reported by farmers using this technology. These pictures show typical spray test card samples from the Environmist Undivina and Spraydo models. The first card sample was gathered at a flow rate of 4 gallons per hour, traveling at 4 miles per hour. This next card sample was gathered at a flow rate of 4 gallons per hour, traveling at 6 miles per hour. Environmist CDA sprayers use low pressure, approximately 10 psi, to create the uniform droplets you see on the spray test cards. Environment suggests that the flow rate be left at the standard factory recommendations and that variation in grout speed to change the application rate. That's provided recommended top speeds are not exceeded. Variation of the chemical concentration is the easiest way to change the amount of chemicals being applied once the ground speed and flow rate have been established. We hope this video helped you gain a better understanding of controlled droplet application technology and Solex invites you to contact us for additional information about CDA sprayers and how we can design a sprayer for your specific needs. Please call us at 707-678-5533. Thanks for watching.